in the next question that is question 143 which is based on vectors and uh, it has been said that uh, these two vectors are orthogonal that means they are perpendicular so that way i will be using the properties of dot product if two vectors are perpendicular simply make their dot product to be zero and in that case you will find that uh, you will be getting an expression of the form cos a minus uh, b right now let us suppose you are uh, applying the dot product formula this will be cos omega t cos a into cos b plus sin a into sin b so that is cos a minus b ultimately you will be getting here cos omega t minus omega t by 2 and it should be 0 that means the thing which is there in the bracket that should be pi by 2 and then ultimately t will be obtained as pi by omega so i will be marking answer 4 for this particular straightforward question. Now let us switch over to question 144. Now the next question that is 144 which is based on Doppler's effect. You see a source of sound emitting waves of frequency 100 hertz and an observer O are located at some distance from each other. This is a kind of question in which the source is moving at some angle compared to the observer. This diagram has been given to you in the question. Simply use the formula frequency observed is equal to frequency of the source c plus minus velocity of the listener c plus minus velocity of the source. Now in this particular situation you see the observer is at rest. So this thing will be gone. This is gone and this source is coming towards the observer. So the velocity will be taken here in negative and that too whatever velocity has been given its cos 60 component you are supposed to take here it is said that uh, the source is moving with a speed of 19.4 so this vs will be written as 19.4 cos 60 degree this is what you have to mention understand the frequency of the source has been given to you as 100 hertz the c value speed of sound has been given as 330 meter per second so ultimately if you will do the calculations the frequency observed that will be coming out to be 103 hertz and that will be the answer to this question 144. Now let us switch over to next question that is 145. 